guys, the day is finally here and I'm announcing the finalists for TBDPC. So let's get started. And um, these photos are just in the order of how I got them. It's not a special order. First off, we have Samantha. I thought this was such a beautiful and simple photo. I love the pumpkins and flowers and she's looking directly at the camera which is awesome um, and it was really awesome because she sent this photo the day I made the video saying that um, I was doing a photo challenge and I thought it was awesome how quickly she looked it up I know it could have been taken already but I thought it was awesome great job Samantha next up we have Joss and I thought this was such a cute photo um, I don't have TikTok myself, but I've seen TikTok like on my friends' devices and stuff, and this is very accurate, and I think this is such well done, and it's such a cute outfit, and like you edited it so well. Thank you, Joss. This was a very good photo. Next, we have Destiny. Um, this is such a cute photo. I haven't been to the pumpkin patch yet this year myself, and this is such a beautiful photo. Um, I actually, for a long time, didn't realize the doll was edited in. I literally thought that you took her like to the apple orchard, or, oh my gosh, the pumpkin orchard, and took it there with her, but it wasn't until, like, I don't know, like, a week after you sent it that I like really looked at and was like, oh, she edited in. So you did a great job editing it. And so great photo, Destiny. All right, next up we have Grace. Um, there's actually two Graces. So um, I would appreciate it if your doll's name is Grace, if you could give her a last name in the next photo you send so we can distinguish the two dolls. Anyways, um, I really appreciate that. And um, I think this is such a cute photo. She said it was called Uninvited Guest. And I think it is so cute. And I love how many little animals you have because that is so much more than what I have. And I love uh, the details and like, you know, the girl in the background trying to shoo away the dog with the hat. and how she's just standing on the table like, what is going on? Like, I thought I locked the door. It is just such an awesome photo and I really like it. Thank you, Grace. Next, we have Lily and Lily is a new doll. So um, she said the doll's name might change, which I totally get, you gotta find the perfect name. But for now, I think Lily is so cute. You edited this so well, like I, it doesn't even really look like you edited it in. It's beautiful. Uh, like the doll itself is so pretty and like all the colors match. There's lots of pretty blues and pinks and I think it's just gorgeous and great job, Lily. Next up we have Grace. Um, this is such a pretty photo. I love like the little bokeh that you can kind of see. Um, the dress is like gorgeous. Like where did you get that dress? Like that is so cute. I love that. I love the cute little like sparkly, like snowy background in her hair. Just looks like it's like blowing in the wind. This is just like absolutely gorgeous. Like. Great job, Grace. This is, you just got my, my mind blown. This is amazing, great job. Next, we have Caroline. Either It's either Caroline or Coraline. Please tell me um, in your next photo, if I'm pronouncing it right, I'm pretty sure it's Caroline. Um, you said she is non-verbal and blind, which I think that is so cool. Um, like I've never like myself think about making my dolls like have disabilities or something special about themselves. And I think that is awesome. Um, you sent me several different photos 
And I chose this one because I felt like it was the most unique with like the snow and I thought that was so cute. Like I love it and I think it's kind of amazing you have snow where you are. Like we've definitely have snow falling where I live, but like I, we, none of it's really stuck, so. Hi, it's Future Marley, and currently outside it looks like a blizzard. And it's starting to, it's definitely sticking a bit. I'll insert a photo, but yeah, that was not true. This is awesome, great job. Caroline, and again, please tell me if I said that wrong. <laughs> Next up we have Aubrey. She said it was supposed to be a fireworks scene, and I think it is very cute. Her face is kind of red lit up from the fireworks, and she's got her little lemonade in her hand, and she has a very 4th of July outfit, and I think it's very adorable. So this is a really cool picture, Aubrey. Thank you very much for sending it. Thank you guys for your entries, and obviously I didn't get all 12, but I definitely got enough to do my challenge, so thank you very much for sending them in. Um, so next week's theme will be Disney Princess, so you will take um, a picture of your doll, and then make sure to include in the email which princess she is and so yeah thank you guys for watching and see you soon